I'm John Carlin, and this is your 10 News Update. One person is dead and another in the hospital after a fire in southeast Roanoke. We're told it was one of the largest house fires the city has seen in some time. One person managed to escape by jumping through a window and is at the hospital. Crews spent nearly an hour working to contain the flames that engulfed the home on Stewart Avenue Monday afternoon. No word yet on what caused this fire. Coronavirus cases in Virginia continue to rise. This includes 114 new infections in our region, with the biggest jumps in Roanoke and Lynchburg, along with Pennsylvania and Bedford counties. According to Centra Health, while there have been more positive cases, the hospital is also seeing more people leave the ICU. We're told that there were 16 patients over the weekend, but now it's dropped to 12, nine of them, however, on ventilators. Masks now mandatory at retailers like Walmart and local experts are shutting down claims that it can be harmful to your health to wear one. Doctors at Roanoke Memorial say most people are able to tolerate a face covering. However, it is recommended that you opt for a cotton mask that is breathable fabric and is not too tight on your face. A reminder that you can get updates on the go with WSLS.com and the 10 News app. I'm John Carlin, 10 News, working for you.